We are getting on the Celebrity Summit. How shady is that? But they're not letting anybody on. They kind of trick you into thinking that it's me and the line. Like minutes That's on board the ship and they're throwing steak at you guys already. Does the ship live up to the hype? How does it feel, hon, to make it to the promised land? Good morning, everybody. Today is November 23rd, 2023, Thanksgiving Day, and we're getting on a cruise. Today is cruise day. We are getting on the Celebrity Summit out of Miami. Um, we got in last night and stayed with some friends and just arrived at the, at the um, port. Now our check-in is 11, but it's just now 10 o'clock, so we're gonna see if they're gonna let us in. So we are here at the Celebration X terminal port where they're processing people's registration. And look, look at the volume of people here on the Thanksgiving day, so low, right? It's like trickle traffic over here. All the check-in kiosks, like next to nothing in terms of just the amount of people. So as a follow-up to my intro, where I said we'll see if we can get on early, we are sitting in a waiting area because they're not letting anyone on. It's 10.30, so we're just sitting here waiting for them to start boarding. So yeah, the answer to the uh, question was, yeah. Not get on early. Our boarding time is 11, but they're not letting anybody on. You see right there in the background, they're now calling people row by row to start boarding the ship. Here we go, hon. You're hungry? Already? So our boarding time is 11 and it's 10 to and they are just now starting to board the ship. And that looks like perfect timing. And by the way, we are accompanied by our friends, Berman and Emmy. I don't know if you guys remember them, but uh, they joined us in our Ovation of the Seas trip to Alaska. Oh, okay, so this is another line. It's kind of like Disney. They kind of trick you into thinking that it's the end of the line. But in reality, it's another section. And then we probably have to board up there in that upper level. Sorry for the shaky camera, guys. Right now, I'm busy trying to juggle filming and at the same time, carrying four bottles of wine, a 12 pack of, of soda, and a bunch of water bottles, plus a backpack and a sling bag. It's, it's a lot. And by the way, this is our first time on Celebrity. So we don't know anything about Twitter. Yeah, we don't know. We're gonna find out an awful lot of things. Does the does the ship live up to the hype? This is a little bit of an older ship. Um, older ship. We usually been told that you know it's usually an older, more mature crowd, not as rowdy as carnival guests. Like a five second difference. Jeez. Yeah. I know, right? And we're at another choke point. What'd you think, huh? Nice. But we'll be the final judge. After the ones we just got off of, those elevators are terrible. Uh, you really? You still remember? Yeah. That carnival celebration? Oh, that's a very short cut walk. Yeah, it's not very long. Um, not long at all. No. It means you'll be able to do your famous ship hop. Yeah, I'm going to do it. It's a pretty smooth and frustrating process. She's planning to record herself in Marco Polo for her non-group cruisers to see. Oh, my after dark group. After dark. Oh yeah, she has a special after dark group. Okay. How shady is that? <laughs> a special thing? 
special special eating. woman right here. Special meal for a special woman. Hey. We, get we, get a we don't know what that means, out. but yeah. you get like a steak lunch. Oh, okay. I think that's what it is. Already? Yeah, we did say like what was a grill? What was that? The like minutes on board the ship, and they're throwing steak at you guys already. Hey, protein for kids, right? Yeah. Well, what chicken thought I'd share with you guys for the concierge lunch? Okay. There you go. Thank you. Go ahead, hun. I gotta be behind you. Oh, you're bumping into me. Oh, it turns around. What a tease. It turns around in this little corner. Oh, but it's still short. <laughs> How does it feel, hon, to make it to the promised land? Well, and by land, I mean I'm ship. I'm trying to see where our muster is. A4. I want to give you that. It's right down there. All right, we'll go. We go. We, you, you act as if we're running out of time. We just got out of here. Oh my god, she's so eager. She's she's go go go. Look at her. Ready to abandon our friends of their time of need for cruising. And here is a shot of not only downtown Miami, but of Virgin Voyages port. And there's Sherry leaving me behind, as you Alright, so we are walking towards the stateroom. Ship hasn't left yet, because we just got here. And we're just showing you real quick the casino. You see here the size of the casino. Hopefully this video does not just to get a sense of how big it is. So it's pretty sizable. Um, walk over here. Yeah, no arms on the chair. Poker. Get more slots. Ashes King. And it leads to a bar. They're letting us drop our stuff off. They're still cleaning. They're still cleaning this area. Excuse me. Sorry, this is your room? Yeah. Sorry, not yet. You can just put bags. Yeah, just put our bags in there real quick. Sorry about that. So we just dropped off our luggage to the state room attendant. Even though the state room is not done yet, they're still cleaning it and organizing it. Um, we heard that the state room might be ready by around two o'clock. Right now, it's around eleven thirty. So it's probably nice of them to at least allow us to drop off our bags so that we're able to continue to enjoy the ship without having to carry a million things. We are in 6047. And the luggage already came. It's wow, 2 o'clock. Yeah, the one that matters, mine. <gasps> Make sure to subscribe, smash that like button, and click the notification bell!